Sniper Elite has a decent amount of game modes to choose from. You got your standard campaign, you got your decent sized multiplayer, and then you got your Axis Invasion. But let's say you don't want to choose any of those. Well, then there's Survival. This video marks the start of a new mini-series for new Sniper Elite 5 players. And this mini-series is going to be a survival guide. Now there's only three survival maps. I don't know if that'll change with the season pass for Sniper Elite 5, probably so, but for now we got three maps to play around with. The first map that we're doing in our solo survival series is pest control and we're going to be doing it on hard now operations these are where you start off on the map and what command posts will be where so you have four selections in operations we're going to start off on square because that's the one you'll most likely be starting on and uh we're just going to pick our class i'm going to go with the gewehr 1943 or if you're american the gewer i am american i just wanted to say gewehr so this is command post able this is the first command post out of four and what you're going to want to do is you're going to pick up as much equipment equipment as you could possibly carry. This equipment can range from teller mines, med kits, TNT, grenades, whatever you need to fight these Nazis. What I want to do for my prep is I want to start laying down mines. Sometimes I like to place them down in the roads because there are vehicles that are going to show up, like armored vehicles and stuff, and just sometimes jeeps or motorcycles. And I forget how much time I didn't pay attention. But we also got shoe mines here for the, the infantry, and with this post, they like to come through these windows a lot and like the back entrance. This little corridor here, I like to booby trap as well. Now TNT you can use and you can set it on a timer actually. The TNT will not trigger if a soldier walks near it. You have to actively activate it. So I just, I just tend not to use it. Later on, you're also going to want to utilize these Panzerfaust rocket launchers because those are good for taking out the Tiger tanks that show up and sometimes the other armored vehicles. There's our first target. And our first kill cam. Where's it gonna hit? Oh. <laughs> I can never get tired of that. But I don't like how... I don't really like how the, the kill cams are sort of slowed down in this game. Sniper Elite 4s were faster. It keeps the pace and it doesn't slow down the action. If you want the action sped up, you have, have to friggin' turn off the kill cams. Now that guy over there is in-capped, which means he's not dead, but he's also not able to really fight you. He can be used as bait. I use them as bait a lot. Oh, one of our traps went off. Where are they at here? They're all hanging around here in the backwoods. Okay, got you, got you. Headshot, always nice. What are you doing in there? Get out of there. Oh, this guy's limping. Which means he survived the trap. But he can't survive my knife. Three left. One guy's tending to his friend. Is he gonna get up? He's gonna get up, isn't he? No, he, he bled out. We're fine. Each command post location is sort of unique in what terrain it gives you. Like, right here, you can climb up this tower here and just snipe from here if you got all your traps set up and you're prepped and ready to go. So this is a good vantage point. Also, every command post has a round where snipers will come in from far away, and they can pick you off pretty dang easily. So what, what's important to keep track of is how many bandages you have, because once the snipers shoot you, you will start bleeding. And if you start bleeding, your health will go down on top of the regular soldiers just shooting at you normally. Now the difference- Oh, don't climb out of the window, please. Don't climb out. Now the difference between hard mode and normal mode is normally when the enemies would show up it would show on your little mini map in the corner here it would show like areas of white white circles this mode doesn't have that this difficulty does not have that you have to actively find them and if you're wondering what the difference is on authentic difficulty which is above hard mode it's just you're more prone to damage and you have no hud whatsoever so you wouldn't be able to check the mini map anyway He's going to he's going to call for help. Someone just set off our trap. And when you got 5 or less enemies left, it'll show you where the rest of them are, which is always good. Baboosh. <laughs> uh he's he's carrying his friend away. Not not if I have anything to say about it. You're dead and that's you dead or in capped. Hang on. Another thing I like to do when the last enemy is in capped is I just sort of like to mercy kill him. Uh, cover your eyes. This is going to be really brutal. 
No mercy. Or, yes, mercy. Could have let him bleed longer. Might have to cut that out. Looting bodies is also a big help because rather than going all the way back to your command post, you can get traps off of the soldiers. Now, you would the only situation you would need to get traps off of soldiers is if you're far away from your command post or if the Germans cap your command post. When the Germans get inside this command post, you have to kill them. It's, it's, they don't contest if you and another soldier is in the command post at the same time. It doesn't contest. It automatically gives it to the Germans. So you have to kill everybody in the square or they will capture your command post. Now, it's not an immediate game over if they capture the command post. You just won't be able to get supplies from this command post. Okay, that's a sniper. See, I'm starting to bleed now. There's going to be a sniper also behind me. Can I get him through the scope? I want to get him through the scope. All right, God. Hey, I hit him. I hit him. All right. No scope, but still a kill. Now he'll now he'll have someone else. Yep, there he is. See, I didn't even flinch on that, but it still says I'm bleeding. So that's a little bit weird. I can't even see on his face where he, he got hit. <laughs> Come on, show the front view. Is that a double kill? Is that a double kill? Oh, yeah, it's a double kill. Yeah, sometimes it's really easy to clear out a wave of enemies when they just sort of stack on top of each other. They'll just walk or run to you in a straight line. I've gotten four kills from two lines of them. It was, re it was really awesome. He's down. He's down. Got a motorcycle over here. Machine gun in the sidecar. Don't know why he decided to get out. He's in capped. He's running away. Can't really get him. There's no reason to use this guy as bait. There's only three left. You should be dead. I'm about to be dead. Yeah, all it really comes down to is awareness, your supplies, and of course how you play some some command posts won't have as much cover as others like i have a lot of cover here now we're moving on to the bravo command post this is going to have a little less cover but there's a lot of hedges around so not really now typically my sessions playing this game mode have been around an hour to complete there is four command posts and you got to move to different areas the good thing is it automatically swaps you to the next command post so you don't have to go running to it i'm going to set down more traps now you can precisely set down traps by holding F, but I just like to quick tap F to just throw them down real quick. As long as it's in a general area where they're gonna be coming from, then it's fine. They like to come from these stairs a lot. Oh, I see you! We're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> oh, that's a TNT. It's okay to leave a TNT in a certain spot because if a German soldier, if a soldier sees a TNT block, they do tend to run away from it because they think you'll be shooting it like really shortly. Now there's not really anyone near me right now. And a way to tell, up oh, there, here comes somebody. Where's the rest of your friends? Are you gonna lead them here? There, there goes your arm. Sometimes you could do what I'm doing and you could chase them around. All right, they're pulling out the Jaeger troops. The Jaeger troops take more hits. Oh boy, reload. Hi friend, how you doing? Coming across the bridge. Oh, that's not a that's not a good shot. That's that got you at a bad angle there. I see you. There you go. One for... Where are you? Nah, you're, you're good still. One for you. One for you. You. And you. Nope, missed you. Oh god, oh god, okay, okay. There's a spotter. Someone just called... 
That spotter just called an airstrike on me. There he is. What? What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> he called an artillery strike on me, and I didn't even know about it, but he luckily missed. The entire artillery strike missed me. <laughs> not great. Not great. Great for me, but not great for them. So I believe at Bravo, we have two more rounds to go here. We're going to place more traps down here on the stairs. And uh, right here, they have this boxed off so they don't come this way. Which, I don't know how to feel about that. I guess it's whatever. Oh, there they are. They're getting out of a jeep. They're back at the old command post. Now he's encapped. Don't you pick up your friend. Don't you do it. I encapped both of them. Your turn. All three of them are in cap. We'll just we'll just leave them there. Now it does get pretty tricky to find them sometimes. And you just sort of got to explore your surrounding area. There they are. Holy crap. Baboosh. Oh my god. Oh, MG. Oh my god. This is why I go with the Gewehr. Oh, shouldn't have turned around there, buddy. Shouldn't have turned around. All of a sudden they just show up. He's down. A good strategy sometimes is sometimes when you see the rocket launcher in their, on their back, you can blow it up by shooting it. Don't know if a kill cam was necessary for that, but okay. That like last 10 seconds was insane. Now there is a road nearby still and they will send an armored car this way, but you got a lot of space to hide in from it until you can get to a point where you can, where you can destroy it. Oh my god! How'd you guys get there? Alright, he's running. I don't know if... I got someone there. That should have at least incapped you. Okay. Now, while the Jaegers are more heavily armored, their face is still exposed, so that's just an easy easy kill still there's the armored car now you can utilize the satchel charges by sneaking up on it and placing it on the back of it and lighting the fuse or you can use a panzerfaust to hit the back of it and shoot the engine through the little slit opening I think for this one i'm gonna do a satchel charge oh he knows he's running away come back here oh gotta go sorry oh there's one nearby it's not glitched is it Oh no, he's outside the command post. He was like, Come on, post. he was like on the border of it. All right, time to go get that. Time to go get that armored vehicle. There you are. Hey, hold my rocket for me, will ya? Wait, did I miss? Oh no, I got him. Thought I missed for a sec. So there's that little. Op I'm gonna switch to armor piercing ammo. And shoot the little slit opening. There we go. Two shots with the armor piercing. And he's gone. Where's the final nine? There's one. Alright, we both shot each other at the same time. But I'm the player, so I survived. Got those two. Got this guy. Incapped one. How do you keep missing? That's my fault, honestly, that's my fault. Who else's fault would it be? It's mine. What's with, whoa, whoa, what was that? All right, now we're gonna be moving on to Charlie. That's the, that's the third one. What's cool about Command Post Charlie is we get to actually be inside. This is a very easy area to defend because you're indoors. And if an armored vehicle comes along, they don't really have a clear shot on you anyway, unless you give them one. So this is, this is a good post to defend. Place a mine at this entrance. They love to come through this main entrance right here. And what's funny about these traps is that they they will acknowledge like the TNT's existence, but they will ignore every other trap. Like they'll just walk right into every other trap besides the TNT. Where are they coming from here? Oh, the, oh they spawned right there. Is that two spotters? Is that two spotters? 
That's two spotters. They're about to shoot their freaking flare guns at me. Can't have that. Got you. Where are you at? You're in cap. I don't think anyone's coming for him. Okay, go back to the command post. Maybe they're coming from the other direction. Got my Panzerfausts if I need them. Yeah, and the thing with the equipment is they respawn after every round. So you'll never truly be out. You'll just be sort of limited if you use them all up. Got you. Oh, baby. Oh, that's a good one. All right. He shot me. Fair enough. Got him. Didn't even need to space out there. That's very similar. Oh, I unlocked the cloth wrap. Cool deal. All right, all right. You're 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 starting to annoy me. Don't do it. Don't do it. All right, one over the... Okay, we got five enemies left. One's injured over there. He's stumbling around. Here comes one. Got him. He's in capped. Another one. Headshot. Beautiful. So I got eyes on two, but where's the rest of them? Oh, they're all the way over there outside on the other side of the building. Okay, they're coming. They're coming. Here they come. Don't make this. Don't make this awkward. Thank you. <laughs> oh, a hard shot. A good way to end it. I think next is going to be the sniper round. I think next they're going to send the snipers. I may be wrong about that, but I think they're going to send the snipers. One sniper usually takes up position over there in that tower. But I don't think they spawn if I have eyes on them. Sort of a wait and see situation. Okay, that there, there's a sniper. Hey, he's at the old command post. Show your face. There you are. All right, got him through the lung. Got him through the lung. He's down. Now the other one has to be in that tower. There he is. Yeah, he just didn't spawn when I was looking over there. Okay, got his helmet off. I got him. There he is. Oof. We don't get an x-ray for that one. Too quick. Too too clean. I have one shoe mine that I can place at this little door door here. Oh god, here they come. Oh my god, grenade! There goes my teller mine. Okay, okay, alright. There's another one. Nice, nice shot. No, you said that he's in capped. He's supposed to be in capped. Alright, I might go down here. I might go down. What are you doing? Stop it. <laughs> Holy crap, that could have been my death right there. Now, see, in campaign, if you go down and you're healing yourself, the Germans will usually let you do it, but not in this. They will they will kill you on on sight. Oh my god, the body physics. Alright, where are we at? Where are we at, boys? There we go. You got an MG, not for long. There you go. That's my MG. That's my MG you're carrying. You're in capped. You're coming up on me. Got your friend there. All right, boys. All right, boys. Oh, got to head back inside. Get away from this guy. Okay, that's bad. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. I'm about to die. Got to get inside. Got to get inside. All right, I made it. Where is he? All right, he's behind the table. Taken a command post. All right, the command post is fine. Everything's fine. Just made a little slip up is all. He's down. I want his MG. All right, you. You're dead. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Got you first. I'll be good once the healing items respawn. I got one enemy left. We're good. He's coming up in the courtyard. All right, we're dead. We're not dead. We're very much alive. Next round, I can't say for sure, but this round, we did it. More items, please. Thank you very much. Place the teller mine right back here place our shoe mines over here because they tend to come here a lot like a lot a lot like a lot a lot a lot now i thought originally with this map i would have to worry about them coming from this little tunnel here but it turns out that you don't because that tunnel leads like down sort of downstairs into the cellar area which leads to that that blocked off uh sort of moat 
with no water this area down here it sort of leads to that so that's probably blocked off too i've never been down there i hear a truck i hear a truck oh they're inside got one. Oh, the sun Okay, out of, out of MG bullets. Got him. He's he's dead. Where are we at here? Where are we at here? Gotcha! Oh, you were cocking your bolt. You're good. I mean, you're not good. You're dead. Sorry to do this, buddy. Game mode is called survival, after all. Oh, that's an officer over there. Oh, I, it's good I missed those two heads. Uh, you know what? I'd prefer a headshot. Oh, they brought three officers. That guy's injured. Alright, two left. I'm just gonna toss a grenade at him. <laughs> nice job. All you had to do was walk a few feet, but you couldn't do that. Oh, yeah, and then they do this. Then they do this. They put the command post, they take it from the inside and put it out here in the courtyard where they like to be the most, which is fine, whatever. So what you're going to want to do for this last command post is you're going to want to put a lot of traps at these two main entrances, over here and over here. They like to come through these hallways a lot. So this is where you're going to sort of need to have a lot of traps. Place a teller mine there. I need more. I need more traps. I thought there was enough there, but apparently not. It, it didn't let me pick it up for some reason. I guess. Yeah, here they come. So like, just place some traps in these corridors while you watch the other entrance, and of course, take note when these traps go off. And you know, you could take shelter in these little hallways too. But I, I place a lot of traps in this area. Kind of want to use the car 98 <laughs> a little bit. Coming from the stairs. Come on, come on. I hit him. Oh, he blew up. Glad I caught that in slow-mo. Oh, I'm hitting the fence. Well, that was short-lived. That was very short-lived. And sometimes you got to watch out for the hitboxes on some of these objects. I I, I was playing survival on, on, on the Liberation map, and I was hiding behind a truck. And the hitbox on the truck was like really far beyond what the truck, where the truck was originally. So all my shots were just getting like canceled because they were technically hitting the truck because of the truck's stupid hitbox. So hopefully they patch that eventually. Where are you throwing that? Oh, and if you try to if you try to melee these Jaegers, they will counter you. It it never works to try and counter it uh, to try and melee a Jaeger. They will always just counter you ba right back. There's a tank out there. Now, right there at the top of my screen, you can see that there's three enemies left. They're all in the tank. It's the tank crew. So what I'm gonna do, since I'm far away from him and he's probably gonna kill me. Before I can get to him, I'm gonna shoot the back with a Panzerfaust. But I'm, but first I'm gonna heal up. Oh, he's actually coming in. Oh, that's like the first time I've seen that. He's actually coming in here. Oh my god. They just brought the whole tank in. Fair enough, let's go. Hiya! There you go, there you go. Yeah, and then there's this whole opening right here. And you just gotta destroy it before they destroy you. Run away if you got to, throw a grenade if you got to. There, oh, he was about to shoot me. He was about to shoot me right there. Oh, he didn't get the chance to, though. That was kind of scary, not gonna lie. That was kind of scary. <laughs> I'd, I'd never seen that on this map. I've never seen them actually bring the tank up. But I guess that's because I, I never really gave them a chance to. Because I always had it destroyed before they were able to do that. Alright, these traps aren't really going off in here. They're not really coming through here yet. But that doesn't mean they won't in the future. We got we got two more waves. We got two more waves to get through. So I'm going to place this other teller mine on the staircase over there. Pardon me, boys. Pardon the intrusion. Don't mean to disturb you. Obviously, in 
a multiplayer scenario if you're doing multiplayer survival this not only goes quicker but it's a lot easier but this is sort of a a solo survival guide i want to have like a solo survival guide for for new players i hear them there's one how dare you get a shot off on me here they come here they come here they come a lot of them ah i'm out that's an SS officer. <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't do that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I gotta heal real quick before I can get to that. Don't you do that. Don't you do that. No. I'm saying no. I don't consent to this. The command post hours. Why did they leave the command post? I didn't do anything to get him out of there. I'm running low on regular sniper bullets. I'll, I'll switch over to uh, match ammo. Match ammo is just sort of like a more long range bullet. Alright, he's fine. He's He's down. We're fine. Everything's fine. There's a guy right here. Someone blew up. His helmet came off. Shot him a little bit. Here comes a guy. Okay, good. Got to reload. Ten enemies left. Guy stumbling on in. Anyone behind you? Yes, there is. Yes, there is. I was cocky. I was cocky. I'm sorry. I'm, co I'm sorry. I was cocky. I'm sorry. I was cocky. Please don't do this. I have a family. I got a wife and family. <laughs> oh, here they come. He's going for the command post. I guess. He's going for me. The rest of them are out there. Okay. Didn't really need to reload there. I had plenty of bullets. Okay. A grenade throw would probably do really nicely right now. Yeah, that would be a good idea. Let's 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 do that. Let's do that. There we go. There we go. They're not really going Okay, now they are. I was about to say they weren't going for the command post for a sec. Oh my gosh! Out of my out of my spot. Get out of my spot. Okay, there's one sniper in the distance. Hello, officer. Oh, also with these uh, black uniformed officers, the SS ones, they will also uh, they will also counter your melee attack. So it's just better to shoot them anyway. All right, he he has a sight on me. He has a line of sight. Alright. This is a far shot. Got him. Alright. I like it. I like it. Perfect. Couldn't have done it better. I mean, I could have done it better, but you know what I mean. Alright. Last last wave, boys. Last wave. Gotta stock up on everything. What's good is they leave you for a, with a lot of rifle ammo, even off of the dead bodies, if you pick up their guns and just take press R while you're holding the rifle. You can just take the ammo straight out of it. They did come from here a little bit. Not in that doorway. Not in that doorway. This one, yes. Place one trap in here. Uh, I don't really know where they're going to be coming from, but definitely put more in this. There's so many bodies out here, dude. So it's just sort of a wait and see situation. Here they come. Coming from that direction, okay. They're, they're coming from the wooded areas. Nice. Nice one, dude. Good job, me. Okay, okay. Alright, gotta switch my ammo type again. Back to regular. Because that's what I have the most of. I'm glad they're coming from that direction. Gives me some time to kill some of them before they get super close. 
Oh, they're coming from everywhere, dude. They're coming from everywhere. He's down. Any more over there? Yes. Okay. They're probably surrounding me. Oh, dude, that's a lot of them. Okay. All right. That's a double. There goes one. Yeah, you tried it. You tried it. All right. All right. All right. Try to throw a grenade far over there. Got to reload while I have the time. Get anybody with that grenade? No, I didn't. Heart shot. Okay. All right. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. I'm not panicking or anything. Okay, one's in the in the post. He's okay, they got a line of sight on me. Got to reload real quick. Got to heal and reload. Heal and reload. They got eyes on me. Throw a grenade at that guy. Okay. Where it oh freaking frick you dude. I just need to kill him. Okay, I have I have one med kit to heal all my health. I'm fine. Five left, they're all in front of me. We're we're good, we're good, we're almost done. We're almost done. I have no no practically no grenades. I'm i I'm gonna scare him with this TNT though. Sorta. All right, two left. You better run. Boys running scared. Oh. And to finish it all off. What are your last words, sir? How about, I'm sorry. Bloody hell, we did it. The bloody hell we did? Yeah, we did it. All right. Thank you very much, guys, for watching this sort of semi-let's play, semi-guide to pest control on survival mode if you found this video helpful please say so in the comments and if you liked it feel free to like it so it can be liked by more people so thank you very much look forward to the next two episodes and i will talk to you later take care bye